हेलो एवरीवन इन पांडा सीरीज द नेक्स्ट प्रोजेक्ट इज डिज्नी मूवी एंड टीवी शो यूजिंग द पाइथन सो फर्स्ट वी रन दिस लाइब्रेरी एज ए पांडा यू आर ऑल एंड सेकंड आई एम यूजिंग द फॉर विजुअलाइजेशन सी बॉल सो नेक्स्ट इज this is the my uh, data set you can download this data set use uh, in kaggle um, uci also uh, this is the netflix data set so you can go to the imbd i am uh, sorry imdb and um, uh, you type the imdb then it show you netflix data you can also copy the path and um, use uh, this data or you can use uh, go to the kaggle then down uh, download there this data mm, uci also and uh, data world also so the, uh, this is my um, variable name df and uh, normally i am using the pd dot read or csv because this is a csv file and uh, this Uh, and next i am giving the path so this is the data set there are 12 columns and 14 15 uh, row 1450 rows mm, next i want to see the only 10 rows because it is the huge data so you can give anything by default it sh show you five rows So, uh, I give uh, the condition ten. Uh, so it show the ten rows. Otherwise, if I am not mention their ten, that it show only five rows. So they show you ten rows. Zero so because in Python index start for the zeros. That's why it show you no. And if we count the zero, it total is ten. no df dot inform info it give the information how many hey, rows columns and their uh, which type of this objective type and integer type so all these like the range index is 1450 entries means 0 to 1 1449 and 12 columns or then data types is all are objective type only uh, this one releasing uh, release year is uh, integer type okay now it is describe uh, describe may uh, may uh, uh, is a uh, show you count mean uh, standard deviation minimum value 25% because it is used for the numeric that's why it automatically pick um, pick the releasing year because releasing year is only a integer type if you see this is the int so that's why it pick the uh, numeric value and show the count value of and mean value shape it give the how many rows and columns are there so these are the row this is the row and 12 columns and df dot size total data size is 71774 next it show all columns 12 columns are using show show id title director caste country date added release date rating duration list in description all these d type its work same as uh, as i described the info same thing is there so is a uh, is uh, show you the all data types is all are objective only release date is now I, i want to check out the 
is there any duplicate value so there is no any duplicate value if there is any duplicate value it show you but there is no any so it's only show the column name next uh, i want to check the null values so there are lot of null values uh, starting 3 has no null value director has uh, 473 cast has 19 190 and next country has 1 2 219 and date added also has 3 and rating also has 3 next um, I want to see the null, null value which is the null value it show me by graphically so I there is I am using the heat map so this is the SNS dot heat map uh, because Seaborn I am uh, run the library Seaborn so if you see that blank where is the blank means there is no any null value where there when we saw the white like this it means there have null value so the director is three title id there is no any null value in director has null value cast has null value country had null value then added uh, date added has little bit null value and rating has also the null value this is the white so if you see the rating is a 3 so that's why it show the only one line it's the rating on all these are the null value this is a heat map next to mm, i want to see the uh, see the uh, uh, using the a particular column is a title is title where, where i want to see the this uh, this data is present or not is a movie name or tv serial maybe it, like the title is a title i think is a uh, movie name so, so this particular is present is in is present in the record so it's present the Keen family title is the Keen family director was the this is the it is the type of movies director this casting by this person and uh, country there is no any country but uh, uh, date added and released release that date is uh, 2021 rating this one rating duration 41 minutes and list in musically and next is give the description about this movies next uh, uh, is a same thing so you uh, sec, uh, same method you can use like this also i am so man mention the kya kya te, ki second ma ma method uh, second method of uh, all record particular so if you, the result is the same you uh, there i am using the df um, uh, is a variable name title com column name and dot string dot contain there i am using the is in or uh, there uh, uh, there either uh, there we use the uh, str dot contain okay and this is the title name so these both are the method you can use which is which is comfortable for you you can use it next uh, i want to convert the date date co column uh, because um, so 
I am using the PD dot date and time and uh, this is the variable name because I want to convert to which column I want to convert so this is the my new column name DT underscore Y is a new column name column name and PD dot to dot date time then I give the uh, column name in data set column name this is the data set column name and this is the new column name which i want to see in data set so this is the output if you see this this is the date and time it um, you uh, show the output like a uh, 26 november 2021 and before this date is like uh, this number 20 26 2001 so i convert is is format date and time format okay now i want to see the data types after converting this uh, uh, date now you see that dt my new column name is dt is date time column name is converted okay now i want to uh, uh, count the value in year, year wise count so how, how many in sorry in year 2009 how many data are used so uh, 2019 the data is used 765 2020 yeah this one 352 and 2021 is 330 so df and uh, my new data uh, column name new column name dt uh, and uh, daytime dot year dot value underscore counts this project uh, i am using the all uh, methods so you can easily use it for data analyst if you want to go on data analyst there is a mainly method which i am using uh, in this project so, uh, so you can understand how to use it next is uh, uh, i want to see the uh, new column date dt dot one then dt dot year then value i will see in the graphical way so i am using the bar plot so you see 2019 uh, there is lot of data is used and uh, next uh, 2020 then 2021 same thing is 2019 uh, the data is this this in the numeric value is 765 same in in graphically i want to see in graphically the you can use this bar plot it show you graphically now and is the next i call in next in data set i want to check the column is this is the column name uh, df variable name data variable name and data underscore added is the column name though uh, sorry dot and unique number of unique columns it show you how many columns in unique uh, number of unique column is 167 in uh, data add, added have 167 unique uh, number uh, unique column 
now it show you in array wise same thing they is give the total but it not show you total it give the data so uh, it give uh, data in turn sorry this is the unique column name there is number wise it give the number of the unique column name and this give the uh, using the array number 26 2021 it show you in descending order in the highest um, is the latest year which is used in data set so 2021 is the latest year so that's why it start the uh, 21st years and last give the 2019 same thing in releasing year i want releasing year so the releasing year have uh, 90 unique uh, column is 19 in array wise there is that is 2060 so it give the unique column name 60 now i am using the group y group y group y where i am using the type it's a type uh, in which we want to uh, 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 count the um, how many group uh, movies are there or tv show so the movies are 1052 and tv show is 390 so it give the output and also give the total and data types is in t int 64 next i want to filter the data so in their data we, i want to see the, the because there is a huge data and uh, uh, i want some particular columns and year wise that it show me so uh, there is a D, uh, df df is a variable name the type is column name is type where i am using the movies move, uh, and this is the and operator then again uh, variable name df and uh, is a releasing year this is the column name also and where the releasing year is 2021 it's mean which movie is released on 2021 so it give the output all which uh, movies which which is released in 2021 these are the movies means 70 rows and 30 13 columns movies are released in 2021 now uh, same thing is there only i want to see not a uh, year wise i want to see the country wise that in france country uh, which movies and uh, movies or tv show is released so in France, it show the only one one title is uh, only one mo uh, mo uh, TV show, sorry, and not a movies. TV show is released. So you can give any country name. You check out the this movie is uh, released in this country or not. So it give the output. So only one uh, country um, um, uh, TV show is released okay this is the type is column name where i want to see the tv show you can also give the movies movies and then uh, same thing is and operator i am using and this is then this is the also column name country column name and then in country column name where i am selected the france again i want to see the same thing are there but i want to see the uh, title also 
because I am not giving any title. So I wonder it show the uh, which which TV show is uh, uh, release. So it's give the one twenty five is uh, is a um, uh, TV show are are released in this this is the title Ziga Ness. Zigento sir. So this is the title name, and then it uh, uh, come in uh, use in one twenty six time. Okay. Next, next is same thing. Uh, same thing uh, is is a type is movie, and then country. I have changed the country name. I want to see the uh, with the title. So which movie present in Canada? In the United States, and we and give the title also. So there, there is a lot of movies. These are the movies, which is this is the the, the Pacific, Mark Twain, and me. All these movies are released in uh, Canada. So uh, these. Um, it filter the all movies and how many time it use it also give the number next uh, i want to see that the movie is comedy type or not how many movies are in comedy types so uh, this is the variable same is column name in column name where i am using the value movies and and operator and then title title is also column name in title value where i am using the is movies comedy or not so there is no any movies are there in next this uh, next is the uh, i am uh, same thing is there uh, this is for you can say that i am fetching fetching the data in particular columns or filter the column so same uh, thing i am using the type and call type uh, column values tv show and operator and this is new col column name listed Le um, i want to see the in listing there is any this uh, this data is available in list in comedy family fancy so it show the two times data 184 show id And this is the ID name. The, this is the number, uh, and uh, this is the ID type is TV show. All our TV because I have mentioned the TV show. If I mention the movie, it show uh, it give the output all movies. So uh, title two time is it's it release. All these are the director. same thing uh, i want to see the that um, michael b jordan is present is um, in data set which is this is the column name cast by the is any value which is cast by the uh, michael b jordan so there is no any cast by this name Next, uh, I am creating the new data set because I want to drop the value. There are no, a lot of null values, so I would drop the null value. So DF2 is my new data set, uh, sorry, variable name, and DF is my uh, uh, old uh, last time using the DF and uh, dot drop and name. And print the DF2. 
so if you see it drop the all null value now there is column wise and row is 8 1 8 818 uh, and last is 1000 something uh, rows so now i am seeing the df2 dot is a null dot sum it count the all null value if there is any null value it give me so there is no any null value Uh, now uh, I'm using the cast, the cast uh, which is cast by Billy. Uh, yes, so is a df2 cast by the s dot str dot container. This is the method uh, where so this uh, Billy use in so many times the picture is casting by the this person is like uh, three times this is the casting so yeah one thing we notice that not a same name but where is using the billy so uh, but name is different billy this one and, and uh, billy uh, cannoli and uh, this is also we are so three times is Billy uh, it's casting the movie. I think this is the sub name. I don't know how pitch, uh, picture movies and TV show get the rating. So how many ratings are pictured is 9, total is rating is and unique very number of so it show the number of 9 and rating in unique value so it give the unique value is TVG and PZ all is get the in unique value. Now, now I want to see the uh, which movie have TV 14 uh, rating. So I give the uh, this is the uh, my data uh, vari data variable name df and df can uh, where I am passing the column name type and uh, in uh, column value movies and same thing is the uh, df then rating is column name. Uh, where I am pa uh, pass the uh, column value TV 40 and dot shape it give the uh, number shape home so it, it is a uh, 37 uh, and 13 column so 37 is uh, is there which get the movie uh, movie which get, get the TV 14 rating rating okay uh, same thing i am using the pz uh, um, which which movie got the pz rating so so there is a only one um, uh, tv show uh, sorry tv show types uh, is a tv show is uh, give the pz rating so only one tv show is that get the got the pz rating okay now i want to um, use the uh, max duration of the movies so df dot duration and then dot unique so it's give the duration value 23 98 all unique values given. okay so here, now I want to see the duration data. What is the data types of duration? It gives a zero. So uh, I want to change the duration. I want to see that 68 and minutes all are show in different. So 68, I first am, uh, uh, I can, uh, the uh, is a variable name. 
this is the new uh, um, column name because I want to extract all the 68 come in uh, minutes and this one come in unit. So I give the minutes. This is the my new column name. You can give anything minutes and second is units. Then df same and then I am using the duration column name dot str because it is a string type also and dot split using the dot str dot split the data it used for the uh, split and there is a uh, single inverted comma where it's uh, used for the space and expand is equal to true so df dot head if you uh, see the data that there is new column create is a minute 23 minutes 90 minute and unit may uh, min min all minimum values now the data is split now i want to see the how many uh, maximum minutes are there so there is 99 um, percent is uh, maximum values okay you can also use the min value i am not using the uh, min value i am using the mean value so mean value is INI. next uh, i have also create the new data um, uh, data frame name d d underscore tv is a new uh, data frame name and df is my old data frame name then type, uh, type is column and is it equal equal to tv show so it show you all tv show there are 398 uh, columns and 50 uh, sorry rows uh, 398 rows and 50 columns are there so these are the all tv shows uh, now i new uh, variable name i want to see the all country value how many countries are there so, uh, it's count the values so same is 398 these countries are there dot hat same thing so now you can see how many countries values are there united state use in uh, 228 times united kingdom is 12 times united state canada is five times united state south uh, korea three times and canada is also three times so it gives the country value the which countries in data set use how many times Okay, next I want to uh, uh, show the value is in releasing area. Is ascending value uh, is, is equal to false. By default, if we give the uh, value is ascending, is always true. So if uh, we have, if we show the value, uh, shorting the value, so uh, we have used, we have to use the false otherwise it show you the same data set if you give the true it show you your data set as you use it it show you the output same there is no any change if you give the false that it show you the uh, value in highest value it show you the highest value so if you see is it to uh, releasing year to uh, 2021 is is uh, highest year, uh, 
highest um, latest year which is use so it uh, show you the uh, latest year um, but in data set uh, uh, releasing year start in 2018 so uh, we give the condition is false that's why it's using so uh, this is the project where I am using the uh, lot of method. You can uh, fetch the data, you can shorting the data, uh, you can uh, get the information about the data set um, and how many values are there. You can count the values. Thanks for watching.